Hi, I'm Unconscious and today I'm going to show you how to perform motion and shape tweens, embedded movie clips, and I'm going to try and explain layers. Let's start with the basic motion tween. Go ahead and pull out your brush or shape tool. Let's use a shape tool and draw a flat object just on the stage. Select it and press F8 and then press OK. You now have a movie clip which you can animate about the stage. So go ahead and click on this bit up here on say um, frame 20, right click and insert keyframe. The keyframes signify a big difference between the last one so this keyframe should be different from that keyframe it's on the keyframes you edit so let's go ahead and move it over there now let's have a look at it it appears to just bounce over there which we don't want we want it to slide across the screen so click on between the um, graphics or select the graphics and press tween motion change the settings however you want but I'm going to keep them as they are so feel free to experiment let's have a look now not bad it moves across the screen now let's see if we can make that a shape moving across the screen so let's open up the library and delete everything we've done so far and start again from scratch we now have our square on its own keyframe on frame number one let's go ahead and create another keyframe without creating a movie clip on frame 20 hmm well, I haven't set it to do anything yet so let's delete that off the stage make a circle over here so now we've got a square and suddenly a circle over there now doing the same as you did for a motion tween but select shape and you will have a shape changing into a circle now you can do that with, with as many graphics as you want and most shapes I won't get into explaining shape hints because that's a bit too advanced for new users but you will eventually learn about shape hints as well to prevent things like this from happening now let's just have a look at what I've done ah alright then now delete all of that again start again from scratch now it's time to explain layers and embedded movie clips go ahead and draw a man just a simple little stick man now how would you get him walking let's have a look oh, insert a new keyframe hmm oh he doesn't appear to be moving let's try shifting him to the left a bit and moving it oh doesn't seem to work that's why embedded movie clips are useful what you do you go back to frame one and turn it into a movie clip now we've got a movie clip and frame 20 we want them to be over here turn it into a motion tween oh that's no good is it it doesn't look like it's walking so we open that up and we're going to have to distribute parts of his body into layers so let's rename that to body head arms legs there now we want to draw this separately out so there's the body Here's the head, 
Here's the arm. Here's the legs. There's two ways to do this. One is called frame by frame, and the other one is just plain old tweening. I think we're going to go ahead and do frame by frame. So what you do, you create a new keyframe for each of these directly afterwards and you change it slightly so let's keep the body as it is keep the head as it is and let's redraw that arm so an onion skinning you don't what you what you do you click on this onion skin outline just here it will show you exactly what to do so here's our onion skins, it shows you exactly what was on the frame prior before it, which you can change with this little bit here. So I want one frame behind. So there we go. Let's move that there, that there, that there. Oops. keep doing that for a full cycle so get rid of that arm move it back a bit more do it again Let's have a look. Hmm. Does it look too bad? Now I'll just go ahead and finish this up. Right, there we go. Now turn off onion skinning. And if you look, I have several keyframes, nine keyframes, each with different drawings on them. It's not the best walk cycle, but it will do. So now you can just click on scene one out of your symbol. symbol. There we go. Now let's see what it looks like. It still looks like that. Hmm. It's because Flash doesn't show you embedded movie clips. You have to do the test movie or test scene. Let's go ahead and test it. Oh, it looks like he's walking now. Oh, but he just goes, just appears back there. Let's try fiddling with it. So he walks off screen from off screen. Ah, that looks a bit more like it. Now that's a very basic walk cycle. I hope I've explained layers well enough. Motion tweens and shape tweens are quite easy, so you should already um, have got the hang of them. Hope you have fun with Flash, and I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Good night.